Hi everybody, it's Brenda. I'm here today to take you for a little walk to this little park across the street from my house. Sun's out, but it's cold. It's like 27 degrees. This little park has a little bit of history for me. When I was a kid, there used to be a schoolhouse here. A two, I had up, one room upstairs, one room downstairs. And they tore it down just recently. It'll probably tell me on the side when I get there. And made a playground out of it for the kids, which we have no hardly no kids in our neighborhood. And here's the sign. Delmont School Playground Park, Marsh River Township is a clean community. The school was there from 1877 to 1964, which is, I guess, when the school closed. My brother went to that school, but I didn't. But anyway, it was the, the building was still there when I was a kid, and here, and you go in the gate is the bell tower that used to be on the schoolhouse building and um, we have sent it to the New, Jer New Jersey Department of Corrections for the prisoners to rebuild it but it looks like it needs redone anyway over here way outside over here in that field over there past the fence used to be a, ball, a baseball diamond and we would always be playing baseball or anything and people would come from other towns to play this i guess used to be the flagpole that cement structure here's a picnic table Sky's beautiful. Anyway, the turkeys get caught in this fence, and so we gotta come all the time over here and get them out. The wild turkeys. But this is our little playground, which nobody plays in. I'm gonna say right about here is where the building used to be the schoolhouse. Let's see, we got some swings over here. Spring toy things you get on and jump. It looks like a little boat. And you got your sun display. You got your little sliding boards. Coming around. The kitties. A cool little park. I don't want to bring bring you back over here for a minute to tell you where I got injured when I was a child. To be right over here, past that flagpole, where they used to be first base 
know it was home plate for a ball field. I was sliding in for a home run and I slid across the home plate on my knee and my leg and there was a broken Coke bottle and they were glass back then. And I ended up with like 80 some stitches in my leg. A big old gash in it was big enough that when it laid open, you could see the bones and everything moving. They moved my when they moved my foot, you could see everything. It was it was oh, it was a mess. And I couldn't walk for like a month, but it healed up, and I still got the scar. So back over this way. Let's see. We got some some pretty clouds up there today. New Jersey clouds. This is just a part of my little town. We don't have a store. We don't have a gas station. And we don't have any kind of anything. We got a church. And we got a post office. We don't even have a fire company. They took our fire company. As you said, there wasn't enough people. So we got to use the fire company in um, the next town over, which is Leesburg. So that's our sign again. That's a sign from the church. Something about. Oh, it's a belch, the Christmas party. Back around to the park. Taking a walk. Back there in the corner of the fence, there was a coon stuff in the daytime, and he was on the outside of the fence, and he didn't know he was on the outside, and he kept going up back and forth down the fence, thinking that he was trapped. That's how crazy they are. So, going back across the street. This is one of my fields, which behind the trees way back there, at the end of the field, I have another field just like this. We have like, let's see, like 16 acres. So like I said, it goes all the way back. Someday I'll take you back there, but it's too cold. And it goes all the way back. There's a little road right back there. You go back, and there's another field the same size as this one. And there's the park again. And thank you for watching my video. Please stay tuned, because as soon as the weather gets colder, I'm going to the lighthouse. Until next time, see ya.